This is the evolution of the legendary Call of Duty franchise, from the first to the last. Make yourself some coffee and enjoy this list. From 2003 to 2022, the first installment of Call of Duty brought a new AI-controlled squad that differed from many single-player shooters at the time. The player moves in conjunction with allied soldiers rather than alone. It was released in 2003. The game is set during World War II, and the campaign mode is played through the perspective of four soldiers, one in the Red Army, one in the United States Army, and two in the British Army. Fun fact about Call of Duty 2. 77% of people who purchased an Xbox 360 also purchased this game. It was released in 2005. Set in the Western Front of World War II, Call of Duty 3 takes place in the year 1944. The player takes the perspective of either an American, British, Canadian, or Polish soldier in 14 missions throughout the game. The game won various awards for best shooter and sound design. Released in 2006, the game switches from the World War II setting of previous entries and is instead set in modern times. The story takes place in the year of 2011, where some trouble occurs in the Middle East and an ultra-nationalist movement ignites a civil war in Russia. The conflicts are seen from the perspectives of a US Marine Force and a British SAS commando. Released in 2007, Call of Duty World at War returns to the World War II era, but this time with a much darker and core portrayal of the war. It was released in 2008. A sequel to Modern Warfare 1. In Modern Warfare 2, the ultra-nationalists take over Russia, and this sets in motion the events of the game. It was released in 2009. It is the seventh title in the Call of Duty series. Set up in the 1960s during the Cold War, the game's campaign centers around a CIA operation. Released in 2010. The game's campaign follows Modern Warfare 2 and begins right after the events of its final mission. Within 24 hours of going on sale, the game sold 6.5 million copies in the United States and United Kingdom and grossed $400 million. It was released in 2011, a sequel to the 2010 game Black OPS 1. The campaign mode follows the story of Black OPS 1 and is set in the late 80s and in 2025. The campaign features non-linear gameplay and has multiple endings. It was released in 2012. Call of Duty Ghosts is set in the near future that follows the nuclear destruction of the Middle East. The oil-producing nations of South America form the Federation of the Americas. In response to the ensuing global economic crisis, this sets in motion the plot of the game. It was released in 2013. The game's story features a futuristic setting set between 2054 and 2061 and follows Jack Mitchell of the United States Marine Corps and his involvement with Atlas, a private military corporation that sells its services to the highest bidder. The game was released in 2014. Black OPS 3 takes place in 2065, 40 years after the events of Black OPS 2. In a world facing upheaval from climate change and new technologies, it was released in 2015. The game is a remaster of the 2007 Modern Warfare. Development began after an online petition requesting a Modern Warfare remaster began circulation. It was released in 2016. Infinite Warfare's announcement trailer was noted for its strong negative reaction. It was the second most disliked video on YouTube at the time. Nevertheless, the game received generally positive reviews upon release. It was released in 2016. It's the first title in the series to be set during World War II since World at War in 2008. The game was a commercial success creating $500 million of revenue within just three days of its release. Released in 2017. The developers for Black OPS 4 choose not to create a campaign mode for the game, instead putting all of their focus on the multiplayer aspect. It's the first Call of Duty without a campaign mode. It was released in 2018. Call of Duty Mobile was released for iOS and Android devices. It included a multiplayer mode, similar to previous Call of Duty games for console. The game also includes a Battle Royale mode, and later in the year, a Zombies mode was added into the game. It was released in 2019, serving as the 16th overall installment in the Call of Duty series, as well as a reboot of the Modern Warfare series. Modern Warfare received praise for its gameplay, campaign, multiplayer, and graphics. A sequel, titled Modern Warfare 2, will be released this year. 
Call of Duty Vanguard received criticism for its zombies mode and lack of innovation. Nevertheless, people loved the campaign and multiplayer. It was released in 2021. Well, there's the full evolution of the legendary Call of Duty franchise. Let us know in the comments, Call of which Duty is your favorite one. Click the video on the screen to continue your relaxation. As always, peace and love.